hello how are you guys doing thank you guys so much for joining tiara's tarot i appreciate you guys clicking onto my video how y'all doing how y'all doing this will be for my beautiful virgos how y'all doing virgos sorry for the delay you guys we are in the season and i do have to be prepared <laughs> yes i had a lot going on you guys with my kids schooling to my birthday coming up and it's a lot going on i'm gonna tell you that right now okay But I'm going to hop into the tarot, okay? I finally got some time to myself. And what I'm going to do is go ahead and get you guys a spread going. Okay, all right. Let's see what's going on for my beautiful Virgos. Okay. Wow, okay, so definitely, I'm definitely, this is not for all of you, but some of you definitely are going through some type of divorce, somebody losing money here, somebody's worried about losing some type of money, but the, the spirit is saying that you have the key to open that door, so if you have that key to open that door, it's like right there in front of you, you have the key to open that door, it's for a new opportunity here, okay, but some of you could be feeling like you're losing money or you're losing out on something here, or you feel like something was abandoned, maybe a home, or some, what have you, okay, and right now you're sitting in your sorrow. There's a need for you to get up because you have the key right there beside you. You have the key to open that door. Open that door, Virgo. Okay. The Emperor. So some of you probably, um, some of you definitely dealing with an Aries or a Taurus, by the way. Okay. But I definitely, um, seeing somebody's definitely playing some type of game here. I'm getting in the game. Okay. More of the masculine energy here. But somebody is definitely trying to step into their power or to basically set some type of boundary here. Okay, when it comes to someone. Maybe a boss, an authority figure. Maybe they feel like yeah, maybe some of you feel like your money is not paying out like it should. Especially around this time. Okay. But definitely what I'm seeing is at this time you feel like there's a need for you to save. There's a need for you to secure your coins. There's a need for you to hold on to what you already have. Virgo. Okay, or this is how you're feeling. Okay, you're trying to secure the bag here, all right. But you're somebody's feeling like they're being abandoned here or left out. This could be um, an ex here, it could be somebody that you're once married to as well. Okay, but definitely what I'm seeing is somebody feeling like abandoned, somebody's feeling like somebody left them out. But what I'm seeing is guilty. Damn, I heard guilty pleasure. Okay, so somebody definitely feeling guilty in the situation. Okay. Somebody felt somebody feels trapped. But it's all mental. It's all in their head here. Okay. Somebody definitely feeling like they're bond to something here. They can't get out of it. But it's all in your head. It's not really your reality. So you need to get out of that mentality. Okay. There's a need for you to take a deep breath, and there's a need for you to just inhale, exhale. Okay, Virgo. Because some of you are feeling really stuck right here. I'm feeling stuck. Somebody's feeling real trapped and stuck. Okay? Because maybe somebody, um, this is not for all of you guys, but definitely what I'm getting is, is some of you definitely was married to somebody. Um, that person is definitely losing money. Okay? This person is no longer inside of the home. And this person might have started a family with somebody else and had a child, maybe specifically a daughter. Or some of you have a daughter as well. Yeah, but definitely somebody wants to work things out with you. But somebody's in a situation right here where they feel stuck and they feel bound to a situation. Feel like they can't get out of it. And they're working it out with someone, okay? I'm seeing a family here. A star could be with an Aquarius here, okay? But this person is off to the distance. This person is kind of cold here, Okay? But this person definitely wants to make a decision about something, okay? Because what they're they're looking at something here. Something has sparked their eye here. Let's see. Wow. So some of you definitely would know. Oh, wow. So let me tell you this, you guys. Because we got the sun card here, okay? <gasps> Somebody is definitely feeling abandoned by Leo, okay? And whoever's feeling abandoned right now, or something has definitely um, illuminated, has came to you. Some type of information has been illuminated to you. 
okay? And but some of you definitely are gonna be feeling like you're gonna be getting out of this five of pentacles energy, okay? And you're gonna be feeling good, rejuvenated, your joy is gonna come back, you're gonna be energized by the sun. So some of you definitely need to take a step out outside, get into the um go outside, go to the beach, something here, so you can rejuvenate and get your energy back here, okay? Wow. So definitely, um, somebody's very, uh, something has sparked somebody's interest. I'm going to tell you that. And it has to do with this emperor here, this Taurus, or this Aries. Somebody, something has definitely sparked this person's interest. Okay. Mm. So definitely, um, something could have been slow coming. Okay. You could have invested in something and you feel like it's not coming through. And um, there's a need for you to feel like you need to hold back in a situation, okay? Because you planted a seed somewhere and you don't feel like it's growing, okay? Oh, wow. So whoever was feeling regret or feeling guilty about something, you're going to be in the Nine of Cups energy feeling like your wishes are fulfilled, okay? Definitely. Even though somebody's feeling definitely feeling trapped, you guys, I do see working it out waiting and wait basically waiting on results to see what's going to happen from there okay i still see juggling here you guys you gotta stay get out of this um juggling mentality okay get out of this stuck mentality okay mm. so somebody already got a clarity about some about working something out or someone working something out with somebody else okay the truth has already been revealed here okay but some of you have already healed when it comes to a situation with an old lover. Some of you definitely have already healed here with the strength card. Okay? And the star. Okay? Somebody definitely could have been dealing with a Leo here. Okay? But what I... Ooh, I'm seeing this King of Swords. I'm trying to be a little bit sneaky, y'all. Trying to come back and be sneaky. Trying to figure out a plan to come, come towards you. Virgo, I'm... Yeah, I'm so sorry, but this person is just always in y'all reading. Always. This 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 king of swords. This cold mofo. Keep showing up in your damn reading. Okay, Virgo? But what I'm seeing for you, though, boo, happiness. Okay? No longer feeling abandoned. Okay? Something definitely has sparked your interest. Maybe some of you have met somebody that has some type of money, some type of emperor status here. Some of you could have even um got a new job okay and you're very passionate about this new job here okay and you focus on that job okay that's what i'm seeing here because some of you feel like you know what something that was just coming too slow i'm not waiting on this offer anymore and you moved on okay you're not in guilt anymore you're not in shame anymore you're in your nine of cups energy you're feeling good you're feeling you're feeling um refreshed you're feeling new okay yeah because you planted your seeds with something for a while it kept you mentally trapped. Somebody probably wasn't telling you the truth about a situation. Maybe it has to do with another family. Okay. But some of you definitely are feeling like, you know what? I'm going to plant my seeds and see where it grows from there. Okay. I know that's right. Mm-hmm. Because some of you definitely already got the truth. Already got your clarity that you needed. All right. Let's see. I'm going to get you guys another spread and see what spirit has for you guys. Hopefully we get some new energies. See what's going on when that King Swords ain't coming back out. We just know that person is still gonna be sneaky, y'all. If y'all in your heads about this person, don't be because this person is not loyal. This person is still sneaky. Okay. Alright, what other messages do you have for my beautiful Virgos? That's a lot. That's a lot. But okay. Okay. So something definitely new has sparked your interest. It could be a King of Wands, okay, or King of Wands, basically uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This person definitely wants to take the action to, to come towards you, okay, to a sword, but a very indecisive. They feel like you're going to reject their offer here, okay. So this King of Cups here, I see you moving on with this King of Cups. It could be a water sign, okay. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. But I definitely see that you're moving forward with someone, okay. 
Okay, I do still see you trying to hold back. Okay, but you planted something here. Okay, death to rebirth. Wow, some of you could be doing with Scorpio, but I definitely see that some of you definitely are planting your seeds for the long run. Okay, you're making investments for the long run here. Okay, whatever you thinking of a master plan, basically. Okay, Virgo, okay, I see you sitting here isolated, disconnected from the world here, not want to be bothered with anybody, but guess what, baby, okay, but I do see you, what you're doing right now, you're trying to manifest, but let me tell you, get in the right mental space in order for you to manifest, okay, because I do see the magician here, and it's in reverse, all right, so it's a need for you to turn that around, get your mind back together, just breathe, and go ahead and meditate the right way, okay, because what I see is coming as an Ace of Pentacles, new opportunity, something new here for you, okay? Definitely. So you're going to have to, if whatever you try to manifest, take a rest first. Get, take a deep breath, okay? Inhale, exhale in order for you to have the opportunity to come your way. Because there's a need for you to manifest the correct way, okay? It's coming, y'all. The opportunity is coming. Well, this is for you. It's destined for you, okay? But you have to be in the correct mindset, you guys. Okay, what else? Anything else for my beautiful Virgos? Three ones. <laughs> you just waiting on that cheddar, baby. You just waiting. You just waiting. You waiting. Virgo, come on. Okay, what else? You still stuck, though, in the hangman position. You feel like something is hidden. And you feel like something needs to come to the surface here. Okay? Mm. You feel like you need to be a guarded against something. Okay? There's going to be some type of fast communication that's going to come to you. Or some type of idea and epiphany is definitely going to come your way. And when it comes your way, you're going to be feeling a little bit defensive here. Okay? Maybe because somebody want to reach out to you, communicate with you. But I do see that. It could be an air sign. Okay? Or a fire sign here. But definitely what I'm seeing is... That you're going to be a little bit defensive when this person comes to communicate to you something, okay? Because this person been watching you. This person been gathering information up about you. And basically, they're trying to figure out the right time in order to approach you, okay? Oh, wow. I'm. This is for some of you, not all of you. Some of you definitely feel like your spirit is getting away from you, okay? Some of you feel like you need to hurry up and catch the ride before it goes, Okay, and some of you definitely are judging yourself right now. You're looking at yourself right now and you're judging yourself because right now what you want to do is you're trying to basically look at everything within yourself that is not right. Okay, I'm not saying anything's wrong with you, Virgo. I'm just saying you're trying to look within self reflection, self observe, you know, observation. How did I say that right? Self observe, whatever. Okay. So, um, that's definitely what I'm seeing here. You're definitely trying to, um, cut things out about yourself that you don't like. Okay? You're going after instead of, you know, basically what I'm seeing is you're facing your fears. Okay? Even though you might be a little bit fearful, you're, fa you're, you're facing your fears here. Okay? And you're basically trying to tap within your spirituality. Okay? In order to handle situations in your life. And I also see somebody definitely is trying to um, come towards you. They want to communicate something with you because they feel like they have judged themselves enough. They've been in guilt. They've been in anguish enough. And they definitely want to come towards you and communicate with you. Okay? That's my beautiful Virgos. That's the meaning. I'm going to take the first two. All right, so, ooh, see? Surrender to the divine and a fiery climax approaches. Ooh, I told y'all something, something gonna be sparking your interest and I'm getting a Taurus. I'm sorry, God, I'm getting a Taurus or an Aries, okay? That's what I'm getting from this reading. Doesn't have to be you guys, but that's the two strong signs that came out in this reading today. So... Yes, Virgo. Ooh, honey, y'all need to surrender, honey, because, see, something is definitely a one little situation here. Okay. Ooh, wait. 
surrender to the divine. See, some of y'all refusing to see what that's what's right in front of you. Mm. And what you need to do right now is shine, baby. Shine. See, some of you already got everything. Oh, love abounds. Wow. See, some of you definitely already have right now everything that it is that you want, but you're refusing to see that for some reason. You're battling with your old self and your new self, it sounds like to me, Virgo. So, get it together, baby. I love you. You know, Tierra going to tell you what it is and how it is. Okay. All right, y'all. That's all I have for you beautiful people. Please comment, like, subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.